Hi guys, this isn't the average video, cause um, it might. I joined a lobby. It was a casual lobby, and um, there were a bunch of mini games kids in the lobby reporting everyone. And as soon as I walked in, and then they were just like, I can show you with the leaderboard. You might wonder why everything's red, but... Okay, turns out the leaderboard isn't red, but there were a bunch of minigames kids. Like, five of them. And they all went like this. They all just went like... And there, there were, like, a lot of other people getting banned with me, but I got banned, and, and my next ban is a perma ban. I just don't want to deal with this toxic community anymore. <laughs> that might mean less girl tag videos, but... I never used any illegal mods. <laughs> please stop being toxic if you're one of them, and please change girl tag. I don't want other people that are new players dealing with this toxicity. <laughs> So please change the role tag. <laughs> like imagine logging on in the first lobby you join, you're you're just you're just getting reported as much as you can. And then you randomly get kicked out of the game, and and then you realize you can't play the game anymore for a long time. So if you're one of these people, please change. There are new Gorilla Tag players coming next Christmas, or this Christmas. And please make it a better place for them. So they don't get banned all the time. My next ban is a perma ban because I have to deal with this so much. <laughs> so guys, please, please just report these people so so they get banned for what they have done to the community. <laughs> Some people think that Gorilla Tag is, is just for fun. <laughs> no, everyone's toxic. <laughs> Especially with the new update. <laughs> Lemming's just showing support for people and they're hating on it. <laughs> I'm sure this is hard for many other Gorilla Tag content creators because they can't go in a lobby without getting reported again and again. <laughs> I just want people to stop. <laughs> 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 
like, now I can't make videos for a while except for, like, mod menu reviews, but that, that limits me too because most mod menus don't work when you're banned. I just don't know what to do to get rid of all the toxicity. <coughs> And since I get banned so often, I don't think I'll be accepted into Finger Painter. <laughs> it's not even my fault I get banned. <laughs> but I'll still try to make real tag animations. <laughs> I might not upload them that much anymore because they're just oh, just very hard to make. I'm not doing any ghost hunting because that can like make a even bigger risk for me. Cause I'm most ghosts only come out when you're banned, so. There isn't going to be any Gorilla Tag content for like two months. And even then, it won't be uploaded a lot because I'm banned for my entire summer break. So, I won't really be able to upload that much. We just need to change Gorilla Tag somehow. <laughs> we need a moderator to go into a bunch of random servers and and probably sacrifice their own account for being banned and not and just not getting the and getting the stick taken away because they're getting so many reports. <laughs> Gorilla Tag really needs to fix their community. <laughs> I might even quit Gorilla Tag for a while. If, if, since you're seeing this video, I know not a lot of people will see it, because I don't, I don't really get on the For You page often, which makes me not have a lot of subscribers, so, for the people who are seeing this, please, please do your best to make Gorilla Tag a better place. <laughs> If you can, then, if you can, then please get in contact with someone that can, or someone that owns a VR headset, so they can try and make the, the community a better place to be. Like, right now, all I can do... Even animating could be hard because I if if I get uh if I get like a uh recording a mod that lets me record the animation to play like Nacho Engines uh what's what's it called but I might even get a modded Utila so I can hang out with other players that are banned. But... Gorilla Tag is getting out of control and... I really hate seeing a game I've spent two years on get completely destroyed. 
back when I started playing in 2021, there wasn't all of this toxicity. <laughs> now there's a bunch of stuff. <laughs> If you're new to Gorilla Tag, don't don't get Gorilla Tag right now because it's in a bad state. And if you do get Gorilla Tag, you're just risking getting banned from little five-year-olds just reporting everyone. Like, if... If someone's new, they can't control if they're in tutorial. They're gonna be in tutorial no matter what, and and it's automatically set on infection for them. So people would say they're cheating, or that could have even been you getting called a cheater when you've just. You just want to play the game for the first time. Just because you saw a J-Man Curly video and, and wondered what the game was for so long doesn't mean it's in the state it's in when it, when that video was recorded. <laughs> I can't even record videos or just... <laughs> I don't know what to do other... The only thing fun there is is just running around practicing routes or modding. Ghost hunting is just scary. <laughs> so I will avoid... Every dark place I see, you always feel like there's someone watching you or behind you, staring at you, and it just doesn't feel right because you know no one can be there with you because you're banned. We need better people for Gorilla Tag. If you're toxic, don't get Gorilla Tag. Get some other game that that is known for toxicity. So, other than Gorilla Tag, because Gorilla Tag doesn't need more toxic players as it is. It. It doesn't need anything to do with toxic people. So please, please don't get grill tag right now. You will regret it. Because you're going to end up not being able to play the game ever again because you get permabanned. My next ban is a permaban. And... <laughs> You see, this is where you will start off in. And people will call you a cheater just because you started off in here. Or just spawned in here. Because a lot of people uninstall their game and, and go over here and stand right here and tell people that they can't be tagged because... No one can get to tutorial because it's impossible. <coughs> or at least tagged players. <coughs> so please don't get gorilla tag. Um I'll try my best to make videos, but with with the with no one being here with me. I'm, I'm just stuck not knowing what to do, and I just, I just want more people to, to not, 
to get Gorilla Tag and to and <coughs> back when I started playing you you would find only like two or three toxic people a day. Now you you see like fifteen. Sometimes it's a whole lobby. Sometimes it it's a whole lobby and a half. There might even be more than than just the example I'm I'm giving you. Like I can't get banned. The only reason I got banned was was for little Timmy's reporting me like as soon as I joined the lobby. Let's 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 create a new word specifically for Gorilla Tag. Report button camping. Report button campers are basically the people who camp at the report button for someone new to join or someone who just got the game to join and just report them a bunch. And... False reporting is one of the things Gorilla Tag needs to fix. Like, back when I started playing, some, someone told me to test out a new, a new, like, banning feature. So, I, I did it, and me and them tried seeing if we would get banned for false reporting. Turns out we didn't. Lemming needs to fix his game. <laughs> or his development team. He has a whole team that could work on it for him. So why don't they? <laughs> Probably because they're focused on making updates. And stuff. And some are just updates they don't even appreciate. Like this update. Oh, I forgot to mention. Um. I got reported for toxicity again. Just because I reported someone... For breaking the code of conduct. The re- <laughs> You aren't allowed to hate on this update. You aren't. Because that would be breaking this rule. So people are just breaking the rules a bunch. And not even liking the fact that Lemming's showing support to people. <laughs> If you are hating on the update, just go and unsubscribe for me. I don't even care anymore. If you're a bad person, then unsubscribe. I don't care about it. Just unsubscribe. I don't want to be known for my toxic subscribers. <laughs> So, unsubscribe if you're hating on the update right now. Girl Tag is just in a state where it shouldn't be, and everyone's really mad at Lemming for stuff that, for stuff that people should appreciate. So, if you're toxic, unsubscribe from me. If you don't, I, 
if you're unsure about what I said, no, I'm I'm sure. I don't care if you're subscribed. Unsubscribe if you're toxic. I really don't want to be known for toxic subscribers. Er <laughs> like, Lemming showing support to people. And people are saying the only good cosmetic is this. And this. And these two badges. Like, this badge has meaning too. These cosmetics have meaning too. Stop being bad people. You are just giving Lemming a hard time. And a bunch of other players. You know some of those, like, YouTube short sounds? They have meaning! People actually get banned for that stuff! People get banned for Lucio running when people think they're hacking. People get banned for that. And you just think it's a joke to put it as your sound. Like, you can only do that if that's happened to you. The best thing about my channel is probably that most of my subscribers aren't toxic. And probably because no one deserves hate. It doesn't matter who they are, they don't deserve hate. Except if they've done something really, really bad that isn't like... <clears throat> just... Their opinion. Like... People say that th you can't report them because you asked for their opinion. Like, their opinion breaks the guidelines, or rules, or whatever they're called. Gorilla Code of Conduct. And since... And since you're breaking the rules still, by your opinion, you can still be reported. And, and the worst thing about all of this... Is that some people get banned for reporting those people. Like, some people get banned because the person who they reported reports them back. Like, what happened to me in one, one thing. Okay, I, I might have to, I'm... Like, I don't understand what I have done wrong to deserve this ban. Both of my mod mods or mod menus, if you would even call it that, are legal. I have Bart Mod, that's legal. I have Rast Phone, that's legal. Both of them only work in modded lobbies. Both of them are legal! What is wrong with people? Like, I don't want to get into a lobby and someone sees me holding air and says, You're- I'm reporting you! You have mods! Like, it's a camera mod! It doesn't affect you! Tired of these toxic players. 
Look, I might just quit Gorilla Tag. I know I've already said that. But still, I mean it. So if the, if the community doesn't clear up, I, I, I might as well. I might as well quit Gorilla Tag. Because I don't want to play a game that's no fun. Back when I started playing, everyone was nice. What happened to that? There, there were people offering to teach me how to play. No one offers new people to get taught how to play anymore. I don't understand what kind of joy this brings to people who are toxic, but it must be some joy that they like so much that they would get banned for. Like, Treat people how you want to be treated. Like, if someone reports you for no reason, you you should report them back for toxicity. Don't you think reporting someone back is... Well, reporting, false reporting is toxic... For me, if it falls into that category for me, but for other people, it it might fall into a category of hate speech because they aren't cheating. But again, what joy does it bring them? None. At least for me, it wouldn't. Oh, here's an idea. Lemming, add more moderators. He's not going to do that. You want to know why? He's afraid of people getting moderator for the wrong reason. Like, I would make a good moderator. Like, some people have... have well, you can be a moderator and have mods if they're legal. Like, Lemming should add, like, mod mods, like, in-game mods for the moderators. Like, there should be, like, a, a report to moderator button. So, a moderator would join the server and... And probably get undercover, because if they know that there's a moderator in the server, they would just stop and... Like, we need more moderators, Lemming! It's been asked for a bunch, and you're, you're just ignoring it. Like... This is the stuff I don't want happening to me. I don't, I don't want to get banned for no reason. But yet it happens. Because there's no one to watch over Gorilla Tag in that lobby I was in. If someone has contact with Lemming, please, please tell him about this. Or please get him to... I know no one else can see this, but it's legal. Oh, okay. Like, I am so tired of going into a lobby and finding the same the some toxic people with the same personality being toxic
gives you no personality. Actually, Like, there are five-year-olds living in a basement reporting everyone because cause they don't know where their bed is. Like... Just... Since you've watched this far into the video, um... Well, I'll, I'll put a warning in the title. Because some people need, like, warnings for this stuff. I don't know why, but they want warnings. Anyways, I'm filling up caves. I do not want to go in there. It might take a while, but I'm I'm doing it. Like, should I just put the first thing in my description? No one deserves hate because no one deserves hate unless they've done something really bad and unforgivable. If, if I've wasted your time, I'm sorry. Um, if, if this was a video you wouldn't thought it would be, um, I'm sorry, I must have forgot to put the warning. Because, probably doing some stuff, like animating, animating is hard people underestimate how hard animating is like animating is like just as hard as what something really hard oh the hardest game in the world kind of like that you gotta get something like Almost per some things you gotta get perfect or almost perfect. Like before you make a move, you gotta remember you gotta move it slightly in a direction so it stays there for the time you didn't move it. Like there is Nacho Engines, um. That his his animating mod it, it's something but anyways no monkey mocap that's a mod but it costs money like dude animating is so expensive like really ten dollars it should be free like, who, who would pay ten dollars for, like, also, um, making thumbnails. You would need Adobe Photoshop for that, and to somehow crush the image down to less than two megabytes, like, dude. How am I supposed to do that? I know some of you at the beginning 
thought it was my mods. No. Those mods are totally legal. So, you just... If you said that, um... I'm sorry. You were wrong. You were wrong. Yeah. It might look like it makes sense because I got banned for cheating. No. A bunch of mini games kids went like, do it. Do it. And if you don't know, cheating is the second one away from the button. And no one... I know that no one likes getting reported. Like, if someone reports you, you gotta ask them why they did it. If they give you a fake reason, you gotta report them for toxicity. I'm... I'm sorry, you might not want to do it, but that's, that's just how, just don't get Gorilla Tag right now. It's in the worst state it could possibly be in, so please, don't get it. Some people get so mad at Gorilla Tag. I'm, I don't even know if I could explain how mad they get, but some people get so mad, like, in the state girl tags in right now, um, girl tag is just in a really bad state right now because... <sighs> A bunch of people are going into lobbies and reporting people like me. Public lobbies too. So no one, so they would need their friends to not get reported. And it's really hard to make friends because most of Gurotag's population is toxic. Like no one wants to deal with toxic people. Do you? If you do, I know... I. If you said you did, you're lying. You're lying. Yeah, so Gorilla Tag is getting... Like, raided with toxic, um, racist, and a bunch of other people who break the rules. Or code of conduct. The developers thought it would be a good idea to add a report button. Because, obviously, you gotta report players if if they do something bad people misuse the report button and end up getting people who haven't done anything wrongfully banned and no one likes these people they, that there's a reason they have no friends and like Gorilla Tag isn't just a fun game, is all I'm gonna say. Some people don't play it for fun. Some people play it to escape reality, but realize they shouldn't do that because it makes them focus more on reality. And those people, most of those people have... Some pretty bad stuff going on. So, you you should really make make girl tag a better place for them. Just make them think that it's a world to have have your own opinion and make them think girl tag is the is a game 
that has the nicest players. And you gotta... Sorry, I heard a whisper like right behind me. Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It, I know the screen's black for you. I'm sorry. I, I gotta go. I, I can't deal with this anymore. I, I really hate dealing with some stuff and I know you do too. I just heard a whisper and, and since Guru Tag is that type of game where, you, it's like liminal space and stuff. I, I, I can't do this anymore. Bye.